Would you pay over $700 for this knife right here? I think it's worth it. Let me explain though. I know you're looking at this and you're wondering, is that a Benchmade 940? And the answer is, yes it is, kind of. Now Benchmade 940 has the same scale pattern, but the blade, this is something different, man. You could check out the Benchmade 940 on Blade HQ right now. The base model is 207 bucks. It's got a crossbar lock that it usually needs some break in time, but I think my boy broke this one in already because this is fidgety AF as you can see right here. Now the scales, they are aftermarket. They're from rock scale design. It is USA made. These are the titanium mollusk scales. And let me tell you something right now. When I touch this, I know it's titanium, but it's bugging me out because there is kind of like a fabric kind of texture feeling to it. I can't explain it. It's awesome though. It's 210 bucks for that. Now we get into the good part, the blade. This is a reblade done by Transparent Knives, King Re Profiler himself, and it is Magna Cut Steel. And it's at 64.8 HRC for all y'all HRC boys out there. It's got a hollow grind, absolutely sick. And check out the polished swedge up here. It is just the icing on the cake on this one. The blade is 300 bucks. I think I'm remembering this correctly. That's what my boy told me. And for those of you watching saying like, why would I pay $300 for that? Who would do that? Man, my boy had to wait two years to get this. That's how full transparent knives books are. He had to wait two years. So if you put the prices all together, this is probably going to run you over $700. It is USA made, including the scales from Rock Scale. They're made in the USA. Drop a y'all thing in the comments. Would you pick this one up if you had the bread? I certainly would love to have this in my collection. I would basically have a 940 that I could call my own.